Hey sports fans, welcome to this channel where passion meets play. We're your go-to source for all things sports, delivering thrilling highlights, in-depth analysis, and the latest updates from the world of sports. Hit that subscribe button, buckle up, and get ready to dive into the adrenaline-pumping world of Score7. Let's begin. These are the highlights on what happened at the final of the Africa Cup of Nations yesterday evening in Abidjan, Ivory Coast. A pack to the rafters Alassane Ouattara Stadium in Abidjan was the perfect setting for the elephants to add a third African title in front of their loyal supporters who rallied them to the comeback victory. The elephants of Ivory Coast, on Sunday, won the 2023 CF African Cup of Nations final after beating Nigeria two goals to one to claim glory on home soil. The 2023 Africa Cup of Nations was among the most intriguing and entertaining of the tournament's recent iterations. The finals, staged in the Ivory Coast in January and February 2024, saw plenty of early shocks and a remarkable run of results for the host nation. Ivory Coast lost two of their three group stage games, the last of which was a 4-0 defeat to Equatorial Guinea. They promptly sacked head coach Gianlui Gasset, even though they scraped into the knockout phase as one of the best third-place teams. Assistant Immerse Faye took over as interim manager and incredibly managed to guide his team through the knockouts all the way to the final. Awaiting Ivory Coast were Nigeria, who beat the Elephants one goal to zero during the group phase. The Super Eagles were one of the few relatively consistent sides in the tournament although they needed a penalty shootout to get past 10-man South Africa in the semifinals after previous strong performances, including a 2-0 win over Cameroon, one of the pre-tournament favorites. Nigeria looks set to repeat their 1-0 victory over the Ivorians when skipper William Trustekong gave his team the lead with a well-executed header seven minutes before halftime at Alassane Ouattara Stadium. Nigerian goalie Stanley Nwabali and Ivory Coast captain Serge Aurier were both shown yellow cards in the 53rd minute after an argument. Nwabali made several critical saves to prevent Ivory Coast from equalizing. But despite his best efforts, Ivorian midfielder Frank Kessie's bouncing header from the center of the box following a corner equalized the score in the 62nd minute. Ivorian attacker Sebastian Haller's spectacular bicycle kick missed Nigeria's goal by inches in the 74th minute. Haller then scored a dramatic winner and completed Ivory Coast's comeback with a lethal tap to Simon Adingra's cross from close range in the 81st minute to complete the most remarkable of the major tournament turnarounds. This sparked wild celebrations among the Sea of Orange in the Abidjan stands as Ivory Coast clinched their third AFCON trophy after 1992 and 2015. What's your most memorable event at the AFCON, and who was the most outstanding player? Let's have your views in the comment section. Thank you again for supporting this channel. See you in the next video with more updates.